Hey guys, Aaron Bernasconi here from Mountain Motorsports. We're out here in Silent Pass, Golden, BC. So we're here today to talk about the 2020 Chaos. And we're gonna talk about suspension setup. We got the red knob, which is high speed compression, and the black knob, which is low speed compression. High speed compression takes care of all those little stutter bumps on the trail. I'd say like six inches, eight inches and less. And then your low speed compression is gonna be your big square edge bubs, bumps. You know, suspension is always going to be personal preference. I find uh, after talking to a few customers and whatnot, we've been uh, stiffening the suspension up a little bit. So uh, what we've been doing is we've been going all the way in with your high speed compression. And then we're backing it out about three turns on the front. On your low speed compression, we're going all the way in, which would be clockwise. And then we're going to back it out two full clicks on that one. So the key to suspension adjustment is if you're gonna go all the way in, you're gonna feel a stop, and then you're gonna back it out until you feel a click, like so. Now that's your starting point, not all the way to the stop. You wanna back it out till you feel a click, and then you start your counts from there. So like I said, three counts on the high speed. We're gonna go back it off one, two, three. And the two knobs operate independently of each other. So even though it looks like the low speed compression's turning when you're turning this high speed knob, in fact, it's staying still. So you can adjust that one. So you can go all the way in till you feel the stop, back it out till you feel the click, and then low speed, we're backing it off too. So one, two. And you can do the same for the rear two shocks. So one more thing to try on the rear shock in the skid, what you can do is play with that one a little bit. If you find it a little a little stiff, you can back both the high speed and the comp and the low speed compression off all the way and then bump them both in two clicks. So that's all the way soft, move them in two full clicks, and then you'll find the suspension transfers quite a bit quicker and you can wheelie more. So if you're into wheeling, that's a pretty fun thing to do.